my gosh! Oh, that's a giant. All right, what's going on guys? Today we are out on a canal in the city and this canal is actually somewhat brackish water. So we're gonna come out. I'm actually here with Bites and Strikes. Been watching him for a long time. Came out here fishing with me to see if I can get him on a big fish today. We got some carp, shad, and we're gonna see if we can catch some fresh bait as well. But the goal today is to get him on his first Louisiana gar and then see if we can get a big one as well. We may change spots, but let's just see what happens. Alrighty guys, so right here we're throwing out huge chunks of carp. We put up five baits total. And the goal is just to catch a giant. We did just that. Stay tuned. Let me check your drag real quick. A little tighter just in case. If you fall in, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> he either dropped it or no, he's on there. Give him some slack. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Nice. Decent one. Let's go. I'm gonna hit the rope. I've never used a lasso before. I know, I just ordered one. It comes in tomorrow, of course. <laughs> Here, I'll do it. Just hold on. Just keep the tension. I got it. Go. Yeah. I like to lose them when they get to the bank. Right, right. You don't want the hook to pull. Let me do it a little more then. Get him over that lily pad. I gotta see him, bro. This is probably a big one. Come on. Let's see him. Let's see him. Nice fish. Nice fish. That might be. That's a big fish. Oh. Let slack. I've never used one of these before. I used just a rope. Yeah, no, go over the rock. Uh, the rope is flimsy. Yeah. Come on, buddy. I hate this. I want him to get it. <laughs> I get so nervous when he gets close. Yeah. Come on. There we go. Almost, almost. Yeah. Let's go. I'll say about five nine. Hell of a fish. First Gator Guard, Louisiana, man. Nah. Let's go. <laughs> Perfect hook set. Let's go, baby. I'm gonna get this other rod out of your way. He's thick. Oh, right as I pulled. How about that for a good start? <laughs> there you go. How about that for a double up? Okay, y'all. <laughs> there it goes. Let's let's get the hooks out of there, man, and then we'll do some camera action. Yeah, this one's right in right in that little pocket. You did perfect, man. Whenever I'm alone, I do that, but I step on the fish grippers. They're feisty. Louisiana guard don't play, bro. <laughs> Is it usually easier? Yeah. Really? There we go. Okay. Man, that is a fat fish. <laughs> Pretty good. Riley put me on a double for my first Louisiana <laughs> guard, maybe. All right, we're gonna snap some photos and send them back. Photo look. It looks sick. Yeah. He's a he's a fat fish for sure. Yeah, man. <laughs> send him back. Let him go. Let him go. Okay, golly. Money. Oh. Let's go. Maybe not. That might be a fish. I don't know how long he's been on. I'm just going to set. Is he on? What the heck? There's something on there. Whoa. <laughs> I thought he came off.
Huh? I didn't even know there was a fish on. There we go. I don't even want to fool with him. He's feisty. Little ones are always the feisty, so I normally roll them. Oh, we're getting somewhere. There we go. Okay. What the hell even is that? Is it a gar? Yeah, baby. Probably gave this mullet a heart attack. Carpet. Oh my god! Did you see that? Did you see that? I've never seen a guard jump like that in my life. That was the most insane thing I've ever seen from a guard, dude. So that's a common occurrence in Texas or what? I've never seen that in my life. Especially in the river. <laughs> They're probably a little more active because of the current. These fish are in dead still water. Oh my word. He's heavy. <laughs> he looked a lot bigger when he jumped. <laughs> Through the rod? Yep. Here, you want me to hold his nose up? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Nice. Let's go. That's a decent one though. Five foot three. Five foot three? He's big for five three. He's a thick boy. Yeah. Dude, I've caught a guard that was a hit black repeller. You can see it like a little Oh. Okay. Okay. Oh. Alright. Get the rope. Right there. Let's try it. The honorary one. <laughs> Sorry. Hey, y'all good? He wrapped me in it. There's a decent one right there. Honestly, we're kind of crushing it out here. These fish are biting like crazy. And uh, we had a little dry patch where the fish weren't turning on, but we think they're back. We just had two good bites. And this is a big one, as y'all saw. Hopefully, this thing went airborne. So that was one of the craziest things I've seen from a gar, but we got the fin sample and everything, hook was out. And that is a big fish, guys. Let's go ahead and let her go. Has it photos? Or no? Uh, just, just not. That's no, a no, that's right. no on the photo op. <laughs> yeah. I didn't have an option. Boom. There we go, nope. baby. Go out of here. No, oh, that's a giant. That's a monster. Oh my gosh! That's a big one. That's a good one. I mean, you saw when I oh, you saw when I set that hook. It was just, it just stopped. I was, okay. Dude, I can't move them. This has to be a six. Way out there, man. Oh, he scared me with these head shakes. Yeah. Dude, this is a heavy fish.
He's very heavy. I think he's getting close to the, oh, he, there he is. He's about to jump. He's about to jump, he's about to jump. The line keeps going up. Maybe not. I'd rather him not jump. He's heavy, bro. He is heavy. Wanna bring him over here? Oh, he's going left. I can't really do anything. Oh, yeah. He's heavy. That's a big fish. Guys, that is a big fish. I can't really move it. He's about to take off. Maybe not. Golly, man. Oh. Oh my gosh. Oh my word. Come on, dude. Get up here. Oh yeah, it's a big one. It's a big one. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh my gosh. Here, let me try and get him over, over this a little bit. Because you can tear their lips out. That's a big fish. That's a big one. Here, let me do this. Go under me. There we go. Here, let me. Oh my gosh. Let's go. Let's go. What do you think? Like six something? That's pushing. Look at that. That might be a seven, bro. Look at the look at the head on that fish, man. Yeah, that might be a seven. No. Girth wise. Look at the head. Girth wise, it's huge. Look at the head on that fish. He's deformed too. <laughs> You're gonna what? I'm gonna pull it this way sideways. So where do you want me to do? Move this? Oh my word, man. Let's go. <laughs> Here. We can put her a little bit in the water just so it's she doesn't like freak out and like put her tail towards it because it'll be harder for her to go back in. That's gotta be six, upper sixes at least. What? <laughs> That's a nice one. All right, let's get the tape measurer. I'm at a, I'm at a 80. Yeah, that's a thick six foot eight, dude. That is a short fish for the width, for sure. Look how thick he is. On that little mullet, too. Hey, let's the dirt, dude. Yeah. 31. 31. 31. It's almost the same. Yeah. What did we say it was? Six foot eight. Six foot eight. It's a big girl. Damn, he's, he's deformed. Look at the head on that fish, man. That is wild. All right, got it? Not well. There we go. It's not like in her throat, but it's like the farthest back before the throat on the tongue. And the pliers would have to go to like here. So I don't want to hurt my right, myself. <laughs> huh? For what? Situations like this? Yeah. Yeah. Here, let me get behind her. Am I blind? Where's the line at? Oh, yeah, right there. What I have seen quite a few times, though, especially on a couple big ones, is they'll have it in that pocket on their throat. And while we're dealing with them, they'll do something and they'll do a movement and the hook comes out. They like push the hook out with their tongue. 
Yeah. All right, guys, we got ourselves an absolute dinosaur. Truly, I didn't think we were gonna catch a really big one here, but as soon as I set that hook, man, I mean, y'all saw he was like setting the hook into a moving car. Um, absolute freaking fish, six foot eight, but the head and the width of this fish is just ridiculous. I mean, this is 130 plus, I imagine. And I'm just at a loss for words. We've been crushing it today, so to have a fish like this bite this early in the day is incredible. We're gonna go ahead and let her go. We got her tagged, we got the fin sampled. We did cut the line on the hook, but it's just because the snout of this fish is so long, we couldn't reach it, even though it was like on her tongue. So that's why I use the small hooks, but this fish is gonna be living a long time in this canal or the other body of water, but I'm, I'm rambling at this point. I'm really excited. This is a monster. Let's go. Where are we going? We've definitely. Look at that. Definitely. <laughs> gotta take some photos, man. Yeah. I'm gonna take some photos. Okay. Like just seeing this up close is incredible. Hey, you wanna go live? Look at that spider. What? spider? Something. That is a beast. Dude, look at the width of that fish. That's a submarine. <laughs> she doesn't realize that she can go yet. Oh, okay. There she goes. There she goes. Let's go. All right, you guys, that does it for this video. Absolutely unreal day of fishing. We caught, I don't even know how many we caught. Definitely few five footers and then that absolute giant. Uh, we've been killing it, man. I think the last three weekends we've caught some, some huge fish. So awesome to get out here with bites and strikes. He caught, I think more fish than me. And that was the goal. I wanted him to get on his first Louisiana gar. We did that and uh, just an awesome day, man. It actually wasn't too bad out here. It wasn't too hot, so. Uh, Fun, fun stuff. We got some some good videos coming your way. I also caught another giant last weekend. That'll be the next video. But as always, guys, thank you for watching, and I'll see y'all in the next fishing video.